y'all this is actually much harder than it looks <laughs> what's up guys welcome back to my channel where i've got some bundles this bundle is from or this set of bundles is from better mood i purchased this off of amazon i will link it in the description box below because i don't even know how much i paid for this i also put it on the screen but this pack of hair came with a 14 inch a 16 inch and an 18 inch this says that it is body wave hair and yeah so we're gonna do a quick weave style and i am so nervous because the last time i had a quick weave was when i was a freshman in high school and i did not install that quick weave myself i'm pretty sure it wasn't installed the proper way anyway because we didn't have a wig cap which is what they offer here inside of this bundle packet um and i did not have any like protectant glue or what's that protectant sealant thing that goes over the wig cap as well yeah we didn't have any of that so it was just a wreck so we're gonna go ahead and install this i need something new As you guys can see, I have already braided out, sectioned out my hair so that I can go ahead and put the wig cap on it. We're gonna put the wig cap on it, then we're gonna carve around the leave out pieces so that we know how to cut this wig cap. I'm so excited. It claims it is 100% human hair. So since I already have my hair braided out, I'm gonna go ahead and put that wig cap on and we're gonna put it on top of our head really tight. I am gonna pull it down to my ears. And then since I do not have scissors we're going to use a trimmer we're going to go ahead and cut a slit right there so that it goes around our ear all right so i did go ahead and put two wig caps on and i know that i look really crazy right now but that ain't even a point i'm going to go ahead and take my eyeshadow and i'm going to use white so that i can create a line here on this wig cap so that I know where I'm going to cut. And this is just to make sure I have where I'm going to cut for my leave out. You guys can use an eyebrow pencil um, that's like white, just as long as it's aligned. Me, I'm a beginner, y'all. This is, again, my first time doing this myself. And so I have to make sure that I have some type of guide, if you will. Cause baby, mm -mm. I can even see this right up top. And then because I do still want the size, like this is gonna be a partial leave out um, or minimal leave out because I do still want this right here out. We're gonna put that there too. Put a line there so I can know not to put glue over that part. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that you can become one of my girlfriends. If you are a returning subscriber, go ahead and share this video. Don't try to hold me to yourself. Like, I love you guys, but like, we need more real friends just like you. So that we can create a whole community. Now that we have our outline, we're going to go ahead and put on the protector. Where is it? What I do with it? So this is the shield that I'm going to put over my um, wig cap so that it protects my hair from the glue because y'all, we still trying to grow our hair back from postpartum shedding and a bad hair treatment. Ooh, I got it on my white line. Don't put it on y'all chalk line, y'all. All right, now I did go ahead and blow dry the um, protective sealant on there for about 15 minutes. So that it can dry down. I'm gonna start with the 18 inch with like um, measuring out, and I'm gonna measure it from this line all the way to that line around, and so that I can already have them cut out before I glue them down. Or I'm just gonna I'm gonna cut as I go. But that is how we're gonna start, y'all. I'm so nervous. This hair feels pretty good. Like it's giving. I like it. And so the line we're gonna measure here behind that leave out line, of course, and but up to 
this line and then under the back and I'm gonna pull tight and then we're gonna sit right there and then I'm going to cut and now for the fun part we're gonna take the track and we're gonna put some glue hair glue on it I don't know why I thought this would be easy here trying to make sure I have it down low enough to where it's going to be enough space for the rest of the tracks. Y'all, this is actually much harder than it looks. <laughs> I thought that because it's a quick weave, it was gonna be easy. Mm -mm. And ain't, it isn't. This one didn't even come all the way up. Ciao. See what I'm saying? I remember when we used to have to create our own closures whenever um, we did quick weaves and we just wrapped it around and around and around until that very small circle <laughs> was there. The size of a pinhole. Y'all remember that? Comment below if y'all remember when we used to do our quick weaves like that. All right, so now that I went ahead and glued the hair, I gotta go ahead and cut around. And so where's my mirror? Got to cut what we did, our little white chalk line. And I want to be sure that we're not going to cut any hair. Typically, we would do this with sears, but my sears are nowhere to be found. You just want to make sure that you don't cut your hair. I'm a little bit reckless right now, so I'm not gonna cut my hair though. Originally, I had intended for this part to come off, but I noticed that I could have left it on. However, I'm still just gonna go ahead and cut it off. And we're gonna see if we have enough of a leave out. All right, so this is what it looks like whenever I take my leave out down. So it looks like we did leave out enough hair. Hopefully you guys can see that. Anyway, but now I'm gonna go ahead and like hit it with my blow dryer brush so that I can straighten this part out and kind of see if I can flat iron it and get it to blend with my hair. I need y'all to understand that can't nobody tell me nothing. And I mean nobody. Like once I bring her, this is Dear Alex. And once I bring her out, baby, it's over. It's over for anybody who ever thought they were on my level. Like, I mean, ever thought that they were on my level. Mm, bust down, makeup on ugh, slay, hair on slay. I am the slay, came to slay. No, but that's it guys. Like, this is what I did. Like, I kind of brushed the curls out a little bit and then I bumped it with my flat iron like my hair and did a little blend I was a little concerned because the way that the hair was looking it was looking like it wasn't going to match my hair which it kind of doesn't but it still works I would definitely buy this again I'm going to go ahead and link the bundles down below the so so that you guys can get those um go ahead and thumbs up this video if you like it and remember to subscribe hit that notification bell and I will see you guys on the next video